Welcome to Chapters of Cancers, my lovely Cancers. I'm hoping all is well with each and every one of you. I'm thanking you all for your likes, your shares, your comments, and your subscribes. I truly and highly appreciate it. Right, Cancerians, let's see what messages Spirit has for you today. Let's see what Spirit wants you to know. Let's see. Messages for Cancerians, please, Spirit. What do Cancerians need to know, please? One more card, please, Spirit. What do Cancerians need to know? Thank you. So we have played out. We have inside scoop. And we have drama starter. Oh, God. Here we go. Okay. So... Something is played out here. Something is stale. Something is done, okay? Um, and now, like, someone realizes that they ain't got it like that, okay? Someone probably thought they had control over you, but they don't, okay? This person could be trying to dig up information, a closer look, nosy up in your business, okay? Or this person is trying to find a way strategically, Um in regards to how they're going to get back in your energy. So I feel like someone's trying to get close to you or someone's trying to find a way to get close to you. But with this drama starter energy, I feel like this person is nothing but bad news, okay? Yeah, breaking news. This person here is nothing but bad news, okay? Don't be fooled. Could be an Aries or an Aquarius. Why is played out here, please? For Cancerians, limp dick, ooh wee. So, again, this could be somebody who you was in some form of relationship with. This person could have played you, okay? Or, again, this is someone who you were married to. This is coming up from quite a lot, okay? Justice energy, divorce energy. There's someone who you're walking away from, okay? Don't be fooled. Show no mercy. And Spirit is saying show no mercy, especially if it's a Sagittarius, Aquarius, or an Aries, okay? Show no mercy to this person because this person has put you through a lot, What's inside scoop, please, for Cancerians? Again, a fire sign is watching you. Again, we know a Leo is obsessed with you for whatever reason. Again, it's like someone here is either reading over messages or someone here is trying to communicate with you. Time will tell. What's drama starter? Yeah. This is someone who wants to start some sort of drama with you, okay? You could have been in a relationship with someone who you are working with, okay? Or you and this person have the same profession but don't work together. I don't want to be with you. So you don't want to be with someone and they're mad about that. No one knows how much I cry and grandmother. So you are definitely someone here who is crying a lot, okay? You could potentially be a Libra or a Taurus watching this with cancer in your chart, Okay, I split the deck again and we have earth signs, especially a Taurus. Okay, or some of you could have been dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This energy is played out or tired of this person. Okay, or um, you could be getting married. Okay, you could be getting married and there could be an ex trying to block this marriage. You make me sick, a Capricorn. Okay, so let's see what else Spirit wants you to know. Why is played out here, please, for Cancerians? Why is played out here, please, for Cancerians? We have the Ten of Swords. Yeah, something is over, okay? No one can no longer manipulate you. This person can no, no longer lie. This is someone who has juggled you or betrayed you multiple times with the Ten of Swords. Again, this could be an air sign, but this is an Aquarius energy coming through. We have the Eight of Wands, and then we have the Two of Wands. So, again, this person here is finding it very hard to accept that something is over. But Spirit is saying that if you have been in a toxic connection or marriage, is over you can finally move on and do the things that actually make you happy because you could have found yourself in connections where you were always trying to make other people happy and you were kind of like rejecting your needs okay yeah we have the page of cups so i feel like again you're going to be pouring in this love into yourself okay you could have had children with this person some of you could also be finding out that you're pregnant, okay? But I feel like whoever this person is who has betrayed you, they're coming towards you because they want to, like, choose you or they want to do right by you, okay? The Eight of Wands is out here and we do have communication, text message energy out here already. So I do feel like someone is thinking about the things that they go they're going to say to you, 
okay but this is someone who wants to apologize to you for something that they've done for this betrayal for lying okay tell me more why is inside scoop here please for cancerians we have the moon. So yeah, I feel like whoever this person is that's coming towards you, they may be revealing something that you may have not known, okay? Some of you could be dealing with a Cancer or a Pisces here. Yeah, we have two of pentacles. So I feel like some of you may be finding out that this person here was playing you via a, um, a text message. Oh my God, that's what I'm getting. So it's like the third party is the person who is going to reach out to you. Oh, wow. Tell me more. Inside scoop. It's like you're going to get some form of communication from the third party. Yeah, the six of wands. This was hidden and it's in reverse. It, this was hidden. The two of swords. Yeah, look. And the phone is here. Communication. So I feel like this was hidden, but like a th the third party is going to reach out to you. So this third party could be a Libra. So whoever this person is that's, that's going to be communicating with you, they were hiding this. Or again, whoever this person is, it's like it's a mystery message that pops up on your phone, but the communication could be coming from a Libra. Okay, so I feel like the third party is going to reach out to you. Okay, what's drama starter, please, for Cancerians? We have the Wheel of Fortune. So I feel like you and somebody could be potentially reconciling and there's like a third party who is not impressed or there's a third party who is ups who is upset about this. Because like with Wheel of Fortune, it's either another cycle, a reconciliation or things are about to turn in your favor. Okay. Your, so your soulmate or the person who you're going to be with could be someone who you work with. Okay. Um, someone who actually gets you because you could have been in a relationship or a marriage and this was a very lonely marriage or a very, you know, one-sided relationship or dynamic here. But whoever this person is that's coming into your life is someone who actually understands you. Someone who you can see eye to eye with. Yeah, look, the Ace of Pentacles. So someone here intuitively knows that you're happy or you're never going to take them back. Maybe this is why this person now knows that it's over because maybe you did receive some form of information via um, from the third party about what your person was doing. But again, this person here wanted this to be hidden. They didn't want you to know about it, but it's coming out. Tell me more, drama starter. We have the Knight of Swords. Yeah. Again, it's an air sign that's coming in with some form of communication. The Six of Cups. And then we have the Six of Swords. So again, it's like someone, whatever communication this person here is coming in with, they're hoping that whatever they tell you about this person, you're going to leave them. So this could be an ex of yours or your person's. Who is doing this? You may, you may be with this person or you may not be with, with this person. Yeah, like whoever this person is, it could be a Libra. Libra did come out in your last reading, but whoever this person is that's coming forward with this communication, they're doing this out of jealousy with the Seven of Swords and the Temperance. Again, it's like they want to affect this dynamic here that's destined. So someone here is definitely trying to block a relationship or sabotage a relationship here. Yeah, it's like this person here is pretty much upset. Okay. Wow. Tell me more, please. Why is played out here, please, for Cancerians? Why is played out here, please, for Cancerians? We have uninterested, exactly. So it's like you're avoiding somebody. You no longer want to be with this person. You're moving away from this person and you're finally putting yourself first, but it's making this person feel some sort of way. This could have been someone who gave you an STD or this person's karma is an STD. Maybe this is how you found out that this person was juggling you because they gave you an STD. But this is an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, okay? One more on played out, please. Yeah, we have bad karma. So someone here is going through some form of karma, an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or whoever this person is who betrayed you. It could be an Aquarius, a Sagittarius, or an Aries or Leo. They're going through some form of karma here. And again, it's like you're uninterested in this person. You no longer want to be with this person. But again, it's like they're hell-bent on destroying you. Why is inside scoop here? 
We have travel. So again, this could be somebody who is at a distance or this person here wants to come towards you or this person could have caught this STD or this person here could be juggling you or this is what they're hiding. They, they travel to hook up with people. It's like a fetish that someone has. Yeah, haunted memories, flashback, trauma, side effects. So someone here could have caught some form of STD whilst traveling or someone could have traveled here. Okay, they could have hid this from you, okay? Or something could have happened whilst this, per this person traveled. But it's being revealed because we have memories here and flashbacks and there's evidence here. So whoever your person is, the person who's going to expose them is a Libra. Wow, what's drama starter, please, for Cancerians? We have shine. Your light irritates their demons. So again, like... There's an air sign here who is mad and the six of swords does speak about travel. So there's a Gemini Libra Aquarius here who could be someone who you are dealing with or this could potentially be the third party. Yeah, photo proof, getting evidence. So people have definitely been watching you a lot as of lately, Cancerians. We have dusted off legal issues and then we have Forza. So yeah, I feel like someone here could be trying to change your mind. Court, judges, immigration, lawyers, etc. This could potentially be a Libra. Okay, forces things on you, forces their way in you, uses force to get what they want. So again, there could be a Libra here who wants to seek some form of revenge on you or your person here. Okay, but whoever this person is who is watching you, they're mad. They're upset because it's like you're moving on or they're upset because it's like you're happy without them. Okay, so I feel like a lot of people expect you to kind of like be sad, down, depressed, and you're not here. Okay. Someone here was trying to hide this betrayal, but it's like it's being revealed. So again, I'm, I'm strongly getting that the third party is going to reach out to you in regards to what took place. I'm kind of like getting like, again, the six of wands, it was hidden. So well, the moon is here. So it's like it's still going to be revealed. But the two of swords is also here, which speaks about... You know, something here being revealed either online or via text message. There's some form of communication coming in. OK, and this is confirming this text message energy. So it's like someone could have went on a getaway trip or a boy's trip or a girl's trip. And a lot of shit happened whilst your partner or this person traveled. And it's now being exposed. But I don't know. Maybe some of you still do decide to stay with this person. Maybe the third party is upset that their plans to separate you and someone didn't work. Or maybe this did happen and you're aware of it and you're moving on from this person and you're now um, in a dynamic with someone else, okay? But this person here is mad because it's like someone here is upset because you're genuinely happy. The Wheel of Fortune is here, shine, your light irritates their demons. So it's like you're happy, you're loving on yourself. Even if you're not in a relationship, you are genuinely happy, but it's making someone mad, okay? We have pedophile. Oh, wow. Someone here could potentially be a pedophile. This could be this information that's coming out. Okay, about this person. We have sapiosexual. So this is something that you know. You know the truth about someone and it's coming out. We have ritual. So someone here is clearly in this energy of manifesting. Why is pedophile here? We have Leo. Wow. So someone here could be a pedophile. It could be a Leo. Or you could have a child, okay, that is a Leo insurance policy. So someone here could be trying to avoid child support or they literally could be a Leo here who is a pedophile. Why is sapiosexual here? We have spells backfired. So whoever this air sign is, the spells have backfired on them. We have Easter, but this is also bringing me back to like fertility, okay? So someone here could have been trying to block your sacral your sacral or your solar plexus here, okay? But you intuitively know whoever this person is that was doing spell work on you, it's going to go back to them. This could also be a Pisces who was doing spell work on you because Easter would be Pisces, Aries energy. And we do have the moon here. So if you do suspect that there was like a Pisces here doing spell work on you, it is backfired, a Pisces or an Aries. Why is rituals here? I can't make this up. Look at that, Pisces. Babylon, there's a Pisces, the karma for the Pisces doing spell work on you is going to be prison. <laughs> Come through, spirit. Let's see what our spirit wants you to know. We have neglect, lawyer, air ambulance. I'm telling you, like, there's a Libra here that is involved. 
or again, this could have been the betrayal. There could have been something here that happened to a child, or there could have been something here sinister going on and vile behind the scenes, and someone here again is going to end up in prison, okay? We have fight back, clearly, because the spells have backfired. Comedian, laughing, Pisces. So there's a Pisces involved here. And then we have genitals. So again, someone could have caught an STD from a Pisces. Okay, or again, it's like, Someone again was doing spell work on your sacral or your, or, or your solar plexus here. It's a Pisces. We have fake accounts. They know they fucked up. And mother. So Pisces and Libra. There's a Pisces and Libra here or potentially an Aquarius and Leo or a Sagittarius involved in this account. But this person knows that they fucked up. Whoever this person is, that's watching you or trying to communicate with you they know that they fucked up a big time okay so closing out let's see what else spirit wants you to know messages for cancerians this person is still on some fuck shit let me make it up to you nah this person is seriously trying to attack you in air sign gemini libra aquarius strong libra energy let me make it up to you try me will you catch me when i fall so again someone here could be trying to take you out because they know that someone wants to come back to you one more on this energy for cancerians <sighs> you in this online energy cancers i don't know someone's really trying to take you out like online or someone here is determined because the world does be also speak about an ending so someone here is really trying to take you out again an air sign or this could have happened like an air sign could have i don't know this is fucked up there's an air sign who is going above and beyond to cause an ending for you okay so again, just be sure to protect your energy here, okay? So with that being said, I wish you guys all the best. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll touch base with you guys whenever I feel like. Take care, guys.